I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? Hive Tribe, it's Queenie Irvine and welcome back to my channel. It is day two of Vlogmas and I have some really cool things I want to show you guys that I got from Marshalls. I am so excited to just show you guys everything that I got. You guys know I'm obsessed with pink, I'm obsessed with anything girly, so that's the theme of everything that I purchased. And before I chat on too much, let's just dive straight on in. I didn't buy too many things, but each item is gonna add a little zaza boom to my bedroom. So first I got this little uh, ornament tree. It looks like, not ornament tree, this looks like a little crafty cute pink tree. Of course, I got it just because it was cute. I put this on my TV stand and it really matches the overall theme of my room with all the pinks and whites. Um, and I felt this really represented my personality. So I'm moving it around to make sure you guys can see it, but this is the item, isn't it so cute? And this was 10 bucks. Next, I got some hand soap. Every holiday, I get a hand soap to match the holiday theme. So this hand soap says fresh pine hand soap. It smells like a peppermint. So I am obsessed with that. Just some basic hand soap, $5 at Marshalls, and I love to get seasonal related things. I am a very festive person. Next, I got this little uh, <laughs> sign. It says, Santa is my no me. Fun fact, I thought it originally said, um, Santa is my gnome or in, is in my home. Um, I just read it wrong at the store. I like saw it. I was like, oh, that's so cute and grabbed it. And then when I got home, I was like, wow, that actually matches my personality uh, so much better. So Santa is my no me. Next, I got a candle. I already lit this candle. So you'll see the tip is a little lit. But this is a rich scented candle Christmas morning scent. And it smells like sugar cookies sugar cookies and eggnog so smells really really good really really good ah, i'm obsessed with like cute festive things the holiday season you know I, like i am so gonna be like that lady that decorates her whole front yard her roof all that other crazy stuff but right now i just got my bedroom so next i got a nutcracker got a nutcracker it was five dollars uh it is so cute i love that it like starts off light pink and then it like moves down to this like red right here obsessed five dollars following that i got this cone it's a Christmas tree, a glitter Christmas tree. Uh, I love the details and it just called to me. I saw this at Marshall's, like there was a huger one and there was this one and I decided to go with this one because I don't need the really big one, but I loved like the sparkle. I felt like it would look so good on my desk and I'm obsessed with it. This was $12.99 and it sits right on my desk. Following that, I bought this little gnome plant. I love that it's pink, of course, and then there's little ornaments on the plastic tree. It doesn't go all the way up for some reason, but there is ornaments, so I thought that was really cute, especially with the little pearl color. Definitely goes very well with my room. My room has a lot of ivory colors, so it matches my personality, my color scheme. I love like pink, white, gray. It just was me, and I needed to grab it. So here it is. And this was $12.99 from Marshalls. So that's the stuff I have all around my room. I have two more things that I'm gonna show you guys because I already hung those things up, actually three. I got this wallpaper from Marshalls, 
so cute, right? Like, look at the detailing of this deer and like the shades of pink, like when you go like this, the metallic, so freaking pretty. So I got this wallpaper because I had this idea that I was going to put the wallpaper on my door, which I did, you know, take it back to college days when we used to decorate our doors. So now I have that amazingly cute wallpaper on my door. And now I can show you guys my hanging uh, Christmas decoration and my Christmas tree because my last decoration is um, new ornaments. I've had the same Christmas tree for a while and it's still going strong. It just needed new ornaments. So let me show you guys. Next I got this uh, cute Christmas circle plant. I don't know what it's called but isn't it cute? And you guys, I finished my wallpaper. Longtime subscribers know that this wall was a different color. I'm so happy because now my room literally feels complete. And this is like an amazing final touch. Do you see the accents of pink? And then the pearls, and then the white over it that looks like snow that's matching my wall, which gives like a little bit of a cabinet vibe, like, ah! the synchronicities i'm obsessed okay last but not least we have my christmas tree i've had this christmas tree now since 2018 and it never does me wrong i love that it's small and cute and i'll put all my decorations down there it's skinny it's silver it matches my room very well, so I'm obsessed with it. And that is my Christmas tree. I might add some pink canes to it, but then I feel like that's tempting myself to eat more uh, sweets, which I don't wanna do, but definitely gonna add a little bit more to it, but this is my Christmas tree for right now. These are the new ornaments, see? These are the old ornaments, so they're just much smaller and very little, and some are even broken because had it for a while. I just pulled back out the tree whenever Christmas comes, but I got some new ornaments so that they could just look more evenly distribute, distributed. Obsessed! Obsessed! I also got a new vanity area, you guys, but I'm gonna hold it down and show you guys tomorrow, okay? So that was a little sneak peek to Vlogmas Day 3. I thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you're in the Christmas spirit. Oh my God, someone just texted me. <laughs> I hope you guys are in the Christmas spirit and you know, you are being cheerful, reflecting this December, appreciating the things that you have already, as well as being generous to your loved ones, friends, and yourself this season. I hope to see you all in the next one. Bye my high tribe.